even though the following morning was stormy and fun, Harry was excited to be playing in the first Quidditch match of the season. from the fall without injury, but he resolved to confront his fear of the Dementors. Professor Lupin offered to help him with anti-Dementor lessons. He asked Lupin about Sirius Black, the man who had been his father's best friend and had betrayed both James and Lily to Voldemort. The professor seemed reluctant to discuss the matter. We'd better get on with your anti-Dementor lessons, Harry. Now, we obviously can't bring a real Dementor into the castle, so we'll make do with a Boggart. The Boggart will appear as the thing you fear the most, which in your case, Harry, is fear in the form of a Dementor. First, we'll practice on a target. Aim your wand at the target. Then, hold down the left mouse button to build the spell's power. You'll see a ring of light move up your arm. For a perfect cast, you must release the spell just as the ring passes over your wand. Give it a try. The incantation for the spell is Expecto Patronum. Right. Expecto Patronum! Excellent cast, Harry. Two more like that and you're ready to move on. Expecto Patronum! That's it, Harry. Just one more time. Expecto Patronum! Three perfect casts, Harry. You're ready for the next stage of the lesson. Explore the surrounding chambers and be ready to use the Patronus charm on a bucket. Oh, <laughs> 
Dementor. No, concentrate. The Boggart has taken the shape of a Dementor to play on your fears. Expect the When there is more than one Dementor, or in this case, Boggart, the creature's presence will likely keep you moving. Cast a perfect Patronus at a Boggart to disable it. Make perfect casts at each point in the area before the spell has time to wear off to defeat the creatures. Expect an explosion! Expect an explosion! I, I did it! Well done, Harry. It would seem you've mastered the spell. Brilliant! Oh, and there's a collector's card too! It was necessary to see how you do if the Dementors took you by surprise. You did brilliantly. Thank you, Professor Lupin. After the anti-Dementor lesson, Harry asked Professor Lupin if it was true that Sirius Black and Harry's father had been friends. Professor Lupin seemed disturbed by the question. He would only say that he had known Sirius once, or thought he did.